Adam the Kanu is right about you. Charles Sudo slams Peter Obi. Um, you see, Peter Obi, I would say that his past record, his past record is what has been um, giving him uh, recognition. But then, I will say that since he is coming in as a president, as a president, we must look beyond that. We have to look beyond his past records. She understand now. You see, if if we continue considering his past record as a criteria for him to qualify as an Igbo president, hmm, we will get it wrong because humans, human being changed. He was a governor. There is a very big difference between a governor and a president. And if you ask him what actually gave him that confidence to come in and say, I want to come in as a president. <laughs> Uh, let us not judge a book by the cover. Okay? Let us not. Because it's going to be too hot on us. Let's check the content. This is evening news. The governor of Anambra State, Professor Chukuma Charles Soludo, may have given Peter Obi presidency campaigners a setback to deal with. A viral post on social media credited to the Anambra State Governor claims that the $20 million the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, invested in Saab Miller Brewery during for Anambra Governorship Administration now worth $100 million. Where did you read or hear me make such false statement. The fake news has been roundly debunked by my team. We can carry on with campaigning for our preferred candidate without consciously misleading the reading public. The report is fake and never emanated from me. Thank you. Speaking, Chasolido Slam Peter will be saying Namdi Kanu is right about you. There is no need to trust you anymore. He won't. You say that. Um, I think someone was saying something yesterday that one of the things that has been given Peter will be credit, credit to go on with the pursuit for presidency is because of the move and action he took when when he was living as a governor he said that peter will be happens to be the only governor who has invited efcc to come and get improved and also audit his uh his statements and also his uh, administration my listeners all those things are not proof enough to get him justified do you understand they are not proof enough look at what chasoludo have just pointed out now look at what he has just pointed out now don't forget that chasoludo is a financial professional you understand now? He's a professional when it comes to financial uh, uh, statements and also auditing. He's a professional. So let us not just go there. I know what he meant by what he has just told Peter Obi. For Peter Obi is denying it. <laughs> My dear listeners, this is the reason 
why I said there is need. There is need for us to give it a second look. Let us not just... I, I, I begin to consider Peter will be anyway. Do you understand? Because of the attitude he put up after uh, uh, the, the, the Catholic uh, Church dismissed... Uh, 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 that's uh, dismissed uh, Mbaka's adoration ministry. Okay? Uh, so that attitude is a very humble attitude, but then it can still be political. Do you understand? Yes. Because if one is looking for something, the person will put up every manner, every manners, and also will want to uh, display some character that will make people to believe and you know want to love it you understand things of that nature so uh my dear listeners i would like to hear from you at least let's know what you think and what's your opinion on this very issue maybe don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.